Guys, yeah. Uh, outside right now, just a gorgeous Friday. Here we are. It's the weekend, and it looks like we're going to find more of this as we head through Saturday and Sunday. No change in this pattern. Just temperatures sort of ticking up a little bit each day. Right now, it's still 60 in Joplin, low 60s in Fayetteville. Where's our next weather maker? Well, it's still off the coast of California. See this little comma here in the clouds. Some showers right there beginning to make their way uh, into the Golden State. Those showers will move through our area. It looks like uh, Sunday night and a Monday. It won't amount to very much, but it will lead to some wet conditions, sort of giving us a little bit of a break from this wonderful weather that we've been experiencing. We will continue to experience even beyond uh, Monday. As far as uh, what we can expect, Back to, again, let's kind of get you into that forecast. We'll take you hour by hour, 7 o'clock this evening, clear skies. Guess what we're going to find for the rest of the night? Clear skies. It's going to be cold. Uh, we'll find frost to start off the day on Saturday. Saturday looks like another beauty, sunshine from start to finish. A little breezier, winds out of the southeast at about 10 miles per hour to as much as maybe 15 miles per hour. So if you're out in the sunshine, particularly late in the day as the sun's beginning to go down, it may get a little cool for you. Saturday night, clear skies. Temperatures down around 33, 34 degrees. And then for Sunday, there's that system uh, making its way into the Ozarks with a little high cloudiness. So I think we start off generally sunny Sunday and then it's going to transition over to partly to mostly cloudy skies as we work toward late afternoon and then overnight Sunday into Monday is when we'll have that shot at some showers across the Ozarks. It's our only chance over the next seven days for some rain. Overnight tonight, we'll find clear skies down to 32 degrees here in Springfield. Again, look for frost to begin the day. If you have to get out early, you might have to give yourself a little bit of time to defrost the windshield. During the day, we'll warm up to about 60 for the high, and it looks like low 60s on Sunday. A little cooler on Monday with the clouds and the rain. And then Tuesday and Wednesday, big travel days, looking good with highs in the 60s and quiet weather. Thanksgiving Day looking nice, mid-60s. And then ahead of the next storm on Friday, it'll be breezy and mild with a high.